General Hospital's post revealed that Drew and Michael were discussing a merger with Ned's company. They've had that thought for quite some time and soon contacted Ned with their proposal. It took a lot of work for Ned to agree to meet them, but before Michael and Drew talked about the terms of the merger, Ned's lawyer set out the terms in advance. And what we see is that Drew and Michael agree, then continue the discussion. This makes Michael and Drew extremely unhappy. But now they need Ned. Do Michael and Drew agree to Ned's terms? Besides Liz is still being treated at Shady Brook, it seems her condition has begun to change. Her mental state is much better, but Laura and Finn wanted to visit her. But she didn't want to see them. Maybe Liz is embarrassed about her condition and doesn't want to break out in front of Laura and Finn. But Finn never hated Liz, but loved her even more when she saw her brave and honest about her illness. Why hasn't Liz fully accepted Finn's feelings yet? What are you worried about? Finn will continue to show his affections for Liz to get her approval. Perhaps Liz didn't want everyone to see her pathetic appearance, especially Finn, so she has many harsh emotions. It's not that Liz doesn't love Finn, but she hasn't bravely accepted that feeling. Finn has clearly expressed his personal opinion no matter what Liz is. He loves and wants to take care of her for the rest of his life. How long will Liz continue to be tense like this? Will Finn get Liz's love? In addition, Ned brought Olivia and Leo to the horse farm to let Leo try his hands at horseback riding. Because Leo is very eager to learn, the boy seems very excited when his father takes him to study and try new subjects. Valentine soon had this information. So he went to choose the best pony for Leo to ride and carefully prepared for Ned's family outing. That was Valentine's purpose when he was so enthusiastic. It seems that Valentine just likes Drew and Michael, and they want to merge with Ned's company. It can be said that Valentine and they are competitors, so will these actions help Valentine make Ned agree to merge with him? Or Ned soon had his own thoughts and watched these people act out in front of him. What is Ned's decision? Whose company will be selected for the merger? The spoilers reveal that Willow will no longer be pressured to find her true identity and who her biological mother is. At this time, the Willow family went through a fierce battle with Nina for custody of Wiley, and they won the case. Finally, her family can live a peaceful and happy life. Willow has also come to accept the fact that Harmony is not her biological mother. She is now even happier with Michael and loving children. Moreover, Carly also treated her very well, loving her like her own child. Willow now no longer puts too much emphasis on the search. With all the secrets about Nina and Willow be kept secret forever, Carly had a headache when the DNA test results showed that Nina and Willow were the mother and daughter. When the fact that Harmony was not Willow's biological mother made her psychologically shocked for a long time, Carly sees that and is extremely worried for her, fearing that she will be even more devastated when she learns about Nina's story. So Carly kept hesitating to decide whether to say it or not. Now Willow is no longer looking for her biological mother, which makes Carly very happy. She decided to keep it a secret forever when Willow let go. Will this be kept a secret or will someone other than Carly find out? How will things turn out?